Many thanks to the Hungarian Atlantic Council for this prestigious award. Also for the work you do to support NATO and advance transatlantic relations. I am very honored to receive this award in the name of a great individual, an influential politician, a visionary leader and a true transatlanticist, Josef Antal. Josef Antal is well known for setting Hungary on the path to Euro-Atlantic integration. In July 1993, when he was Prime Minister, he said that Hungary's most important aim is to achieve accession to the European Union and NATO within this decade. It was a bold statement. It provided a great aspiration for a young democracy that had been under communist rule and foreign domination for four decades. Josef Antal did not live to see his vision come through. But in 1999, Hungary joined the NATO family and the European Union a few years later. Hungary has been a valued NATO ally ever since. Today, it leads one of our multinational battlegroups, helping to deter aggression, and hosts important military headquarters, including our multinational division center. Hungary also supports our efforts for stability in the Western Balkans, including by leading our K4 peacekeeping mission in Kosovo last year. Just like Hungary joined NATO 25 years ago, most recently Finland became our 31st ally. And soon Sweden will be our 32nd one. Our alliance is getting bigger and stronger. This matters for our shared security in these dangerous times. Russia's war against Ukraine rages on. There is war in the Middle East, tensions in the Western Balkans, brutal terrorism persists, climate change is driving conflicts. And more than ever, our democratic values are under pressure, and authoritarian regimes are trampling the global rules. The best and only way to tackle security challenges, preserve peace, and protect our people and values is for Europe and North America to stand united in a strong NATO. This is also what Josef Antal believed. He often referred to the alliance as the cornerstone of European stability. This is as true now as it was in the early 1990s and as it has been for 75 years. Looking ahead to the Washington summit in July, I count on Hungary and all NATO allies together to keep the transatlantic bond solid and NATO strong. Thank you so much.